Yeah, hi there, Christique. This is Michael, the founder, owner, and the materials writer of the 7 Step System to pass the TOEFL IBT. And as always, it's always a pleasure to hear from you. And don't forget me, when you take the TOEFL test, come back and tell me how high of a score you got. I got a really good feeling uh, about you. Okay, so with this one, this is actually a very tough question. And as you know, this actually appeared on the TOEFL IBT. This is one of those questions that my students have submitted and told me after taking the TOEFL. And I think if I remember correctly, I have 20 different questions of, of tasks that actually appeared on the official TOEFL IBT. So the question here is, do you think it's easier to eat healthy food today? Now, the only thing you didn't do in the very beginning is you didn't include your topic statement that mentioned people are busier and it's more time consuming which makes it difficult to prepare healthy food you didn't really say that in the very beginning nevertheless you went to your first point you said people are busy now and it's hard for them to uh, prepare foods so instead of cooking at home they buy things at a restaurant and bring them home now the only thing you didn't make the connection of is you you should probably say something about they buy the unhealthy foods or the foods high in fat and sugar from restaurants and then bring them home so there wasn't an exactly I'm being a little picky I know but there wasn't an exactly a, a really good cause effect relationship between eating out and having unhealthy food versus eating at home and having more healthy food right but again I'm not sure that you had to exactly do that but the other idea that you said is a time-consuming process so you mentioned those points you gave some details so I think here uh, in terms of your score let me look at the rubrics really fast so I think topic development it's pretty good I, I think that uh, your response is coherent, it's relevant to the task, but the only thing that might not be as relevant is the connection between eating out and being unhealthy versus eating at home, which is healthy. I, I'm not sure if, you probably have to do that just a little bit more than what you did. But you definitely have good details to explain your main ideas. Uh, you had pretty good control, I think, of your grammar and your language use. Your delivery, you had some minor pronunciation problems. Uh, I'm going to say in this one, I don't think you'll get 26. I'm going to put you at 24 points out of 30 on this practice test.